Alright, so Chad is going to drive me back to Gon's house. I decided to take Aluto with me again as well. Kaluto wanted to go too but I turned that shit down real quick. Why can't I go? You're not gonna go because I bet you'll just go and snitch to mum about everything. Now go away small one. No I won't, I'm not a snitch. Who's going to regret that? Illumi, Illumi, I have to tell you something. What? Killer is going back to Gon's house. What? Gon? How does that little shit always end up stealing everyone away from me? I got an idea. I'll call Killua while crying and tell him that there's some big emergency and he has to come home right away. Will that work? Um, do you think I would come up with an idea that wouldn't work? Don't ever ask some stupid shit like that again. Killua, why do you keep randomly showing up here? Gone the light of my life freaks. How the heck are you, buddy? I'm good, but Jesus fucking Christ, not again. Hi, Kim. Hey, can you talk for a sec? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, no, I can barely hear you. Ugh, can you hear me now? That little shit hung the phone up on me. Mayo, I knew his dumbest plan wasn't gonna work. I called him back and threatened that I was gonna drive over there and bring him back myself. LMFAO, I ain't gonna ride in his ugly ass car. The fuck? Nah nah. I'm just gonna kidnap Gon. Quick, Aluka. Illumi's already on his way here. You and Chad go get the car started. I'll go steal the Gon. Broom, broom. I'll just hide Gon at my house for a bit, lol. Hey yo, what the fuck? So, I decided to take Kaluto with me to go get Killua. So I've never been in the car while Illumi is driving. Scariest shit of my life. Oh shit! Jesus! You, you, you follow people so closely. How am I, okay, you are like a, like a road rage person. I'm just not as like, oh my god, the guy up there has his brakes on! Oh, oh no! Hurry! Oh, like, that alone is gonna make you crash because you're spastic. Fantastic. Like, you're lucky that I'm calm. I am so lucky. Because if I actually was like a nervous driver, you would have made me turn the car over the edge. I've never felt so insane. We arrived at Gon's house, but Killua was nowhere to be found. We decided to ask the residents of the house. So what exactly happened here, miss? Well, Killua just randomly showed up here. Uh -huh. He said that he wanted okay. to talk. He wanted to talk to yes. Gon, though. Then he got a call from you. Mayo. I'm sorry, can I speak? Ma'am, you were literally just talking to me. I think you can speak fine. No, Illumi, she means she wants you to stop interrupting her. The fuck? I wasn't interrupting her. The bitch is probably just hallucinating. Illumi, she's right there, she can hear you. Who can? For the love of God. I'm sorry, go ahead. Thank you. After the phone call, he just took gone Penis and LOL. Get off my property. Well, that lady was no help at all. How will we ever know what happened to Killua? Illumi, she literally told us exactly what happened. Now we'll never know. Thanks a lot, Aunt Mia Ho. It's me too. And then she had the audacity to call the cops on me and have me removed. It's a good thing I ran away and hid in the car. I might be parked right in front of her house, but I also camouflaged the car so no one will ever find it inconspicuous. Is that him? Yeah, that's him over there in that really ugly ass depressed Bart Simpson themed car. Oh, you fucking bitch. You dumb fuck. Sir, please step out of the car. Hand me your license. You don't need to see that. Yes, I do. Hand it over. Is this license made of cardboard? Ah, uh, no. This is the fakest shit I've ever seen. But, how could you tell it was fake? You wrote your name with glitter glue. Wait, aren't you the guy who's committed multiple traffic offenses? Ah ha ha, ah, no. Why hasn't he been arrested sooner? Because he's scary. Look at him. You're all pussies. Sir, you're going to jail. The police called my family to tell them the bad news. My dad said he was going to visit Illumi and ask for us to come with. To be completely honest, I could not miss his grand send-off to his life behind bars. This honestly is the best thing that could ever happen to me. I'm hiding gone at my house and Illumi's in jail. Luck just loves me. I could tell everyone was a bit tense in the car face with big bleeding eyes. Crying face. Kim, would you stop taking pictures of yourself? Your sister's going to jail. Please Here, Kim, this one. I feel like I'm gonna barf. Good, throw up. We finally got there and we got to talk to Illumi's astonished face. Confounded face. I just can't believe this. Loudly crying face. Loudly crying face. Sad pensive face. I can. What about your car? Pitiful face with blue forehead. Sad but relieved face with sweat. Face with hand over mouth and rosy cheeks. They are confiscating it. That's the universe telling you that your car's ugly as fuck. Hey Killua, why don't you shut the fuck up? Hey Illumi, why don't you learn how to fucking drive? I can drive. Yeah, not like a normal person though. LMFAO no Killua wait. Remember he has a license. A license proves you can drive. Oh my gosh, I almost forgot. Silly me. His cardboard license proves he can drive. Illumi, serious question. where do you get your cardboard license? Was it a FedEx or Amazon box? I'm going to fucking kill you. You're gonna what? After my family left, the officer showed me to my cell. This will be your cell for a long time so you better get used to it, along with your new cellmate as well. Get in. Damn okay fine whatever you say bitch. Excuse you? The fuck you just say to me? I said damn obey fine but never chew gay switch.
get in the fucking cell. Okay. Hey, Mac. What are you in for? Hisoka, what the fuck are you doing here? Well, it's actually a hilarious story. You'll love it. Recalculating. Recalculating. What the fuck is wrong with this GPS? Where the fuck even am I? Yo, wait, is that a school? Am I in a school zone? Shit, I'm not supposed to be within 500 feet of these. I gotta get out of here. Wait, isn't there a speed limit in school zones? Continue point seven miles. And that's how I got arrested. Hee <laughs> hee. So you were speeding in a school zone and you ran over a child? Lmeo oh yeah. Okay, that is kinda funny. Right. Well, it's not all bad here though. What do you mean? Have you seen how hot the officers are? Hello, have you done any work today at all? Not at all. I've just been sitting here lol. Posing. I swear to god I can't wait till the day you're fired. You whore. Lmeo I know but anyways to change the subject quickly before you hit me or something. The kid I ran over is still alive and he and his legal guardian are gonna sue me. And how is that my problem? Well if they sue me and I lose everything, including my house, I might just be homeless. If it came to that, would you let me stay at your house you woo? We're both in prison you dumb fuck. Losing your house doesn't even matter at this point. Makes very sad face you woo I knew you wouldn't care. I guess I'm just too ugly. But if I died, would you care? Okay first you start talking with emojis and now this shit. What the fuck is this? How are you making your subtitles show up like that? Turns away as my transparent tear stream down the cheeks of my porcelain skinned face. Sneering my makeup. Yeah. I kinda figured that would be your answer. If there was any hope for the existence of a merciful god he would have given me any other cell mate except you. I was honestly so worried about how it was going to be living in prison but now that I know that Hisoka just happens to be my cellmate, I just know it's going to be hell. You woo. You woo you woo. Hisoka. Stop. You woo woo woo. Seriously Hisoka. Stop. You woo you woo 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 woo. It's not funny and it's not cute. Shut the fuck up. I swear to fucking god I'm going to murder you. Hello. Hello. Uh, hello. Hey guys it's me. Officer Crollo. Okay. I came in here because Hisoka has a visitor. Is it the kid I ran over? Yeah. Come with me please. Finally I can get some peace and quiet away from him. Hey what's up kid? Please do not speak to Sushi. I can speak to Sushi anytime I want thank you very much. So Sushi, how the fuck did you manage to live? I thought for sure that I had killed you. My name is Sushi. And stop talking to me you meanie. Oh looks like Lil Sushi's still got some life in him. Those are fighting words mister. Butthead. I bet that dude's not even your real dad. You're probably adopted. I bet no one wanted you because your name's Sushi and you look like one of the characters from the old Planet of the Apes movies. Shut up. I'm just built different. Maybe if you keep telling yourself that you'll believe it one day. Hey I'm back. Oh Christ. So turns out they just needed me to sign some papers. I was so confused as to why that dude kept telling me to stop talking to the sushi kid. Turns out they want to file a restraining order as well. I wish I wasn't stuck in here with you. I wonder how my family is. I wonder what killer is doing. This sleepover is going to be so much fun killer. And you got Aunt Mito's permission right? Yeah of course I did Mayo anyways gone I just want to say. I'm so excited. Me too. Hey killer, what happened to your scary mean older brother? Oh, uh, but guys got arrested Mayo. The bitch had it coming. I get the feeling that he's talking about me. I bet he's talking about how noble I am. Yes! She is a bitch. B-I-C-T-H. Wanna try to escape? I'm down. So killer, are you sure it's okay for me to be here? I'm just gonna hide you from my parents for a bit. Other than that you should be fine. Well maybe as long as Kaluto doesn't see you either. What the fuck? Oh shit. Kaluto and Aluko ended up taking Gon into another room to grill him with questions. Tell us a little something about yourself. As for what? Well, I just wanna get to know you more. Where did you grow up? Atlanta, Georgia. What exactly do you do for a living? It's not about a title, just basically make it happen in the music industry. What do you and my mom even do together? What, like hanging out? So how much time do you spend together? We spend a lot of time together. I mean, I don't know. I'm just asking because my dad was always away. So like, they, I don't know. I genuinely think Corey cares about my mom and loves her. My mom has been through a lot, and to see someone taking care of her and really giving her everything she needs is really great. So what did they ask you? LOL Kilo, I think they suspect you of being a little fruity. Toaster. Strudels. So now, officially, all three of my siblings here know that I'm hiding gone from my parents. Now poor Gon can't get a break. They keep asking him so much questions and it's fucking ridiculous. What's your blood type? What is your credit score? Do you have siblings? God, you guys, are you interrogating this poor girl? <laughs> so what does Courtney tell you about us? Who's her favorite? What the f*** did you do to Courtney to make her so happy? I tried to take Gon back to my room to have some alone time so we could play this new video game I bought that I thought he would really like. But of course someone else was waiting there for us. Now we can finally play that game I bought. Chad, what the f*** are you doing in my room? Alright Chad, you might be drip god, but I'm gonna have to ask you to leave. I don't care how bad you need to be on camera. 
bug your cameo, and bug your drip, respectfully. Wow. So what's the game killer? It's a VR fishing simulator. This VR is so realistic killer. Yeah I know. Obviously it's because I can afford to get the best of the best. Killer, you are my best friend in the world, and I care about you a lot, but I swear to god if you flex the fact that you're rich one more time, I'm going to deck your bitch ass. Sorry. I'm gonna go downstream, you go upstream, okay, okay. Is there more fish upstream? Gone. Gone. Did he actually walk upstream? Like out of the fucking room. Shit. Chad, my son, how could you betray me? You are my son, I named you, I created you. Jeez this river sure is big. So now even my grandpa knows that Gon is here. Please 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 don't tell my parents. I'm begging you. You don't have to worry about that killer. I don't. No. No you don't. Because I'm cool. I'm the cool grandpa. You are. Yes. Yes I am. And I'm cooler than your dad. Because I can keep secrets. Gather up your siblings killer. I wanna talk to you all. Okay. Alright guys. So we all know that killer is hiding Gon from his mom and dad. I, your fun grandpa, will be in on this secret from now on. Is that all you wanted to say? Yes. Then why? Oh, also, I would like you kids to spend more time with me. So, I'm gonna take all of you to go see a movie, including Gon. Seriously? Yes. Because I'm the nice grandpa that everyone loves. And everything is on me. Popcorn. Snacks. You name it. Except for you Malupi. Oh playing favorites again Actually, I Actually yes I am you got a problem with that. No I guess. So what movie are we going to see? Grandpa Zeno told us all to head to the movie theaters and wait for him there because he had to do something first. He said he would tell us what movie we're going to see when we all meet up. To be honest, it was actually really fun hanging out with everyone in the limo. I want to be friends with all of them. Dare I say, it's a little quiet in this car. Yeah, it is. Well we need to fix that. Driver, kindly pass me that auxiliary cord my good sir. Do you not have Bluetooth? No the dentist said my teeth are perfect. No that- Alright besties, I'm about to bless your ears with a banger that I personally helped produce. Oh and um, trigger warning, this shit slaps. Peanut butter on my balls, let the dog lick it. Peanut butter on my balls, let the dog lick it. OMG, is this to baby? Yeah.